per ounce of gold. So I asked that question before I went to break. Which country had the best performing market in 2010? Hint to all of you, it was not the United States of America. Give up? Well, guess what? The best performing global market was Sri Lanka's CSE. It was up 96% for the year. Sri Lanka is an island nation with a rich cultural heritage and a written history of over 2,500 years. Nestled below the southern tip of India, Sri Lanka is home to 21 million ethnically diverse people, including Sinhalese, Tamils, Muslims, Burgers, and Malays. It is Asia's oldest democracy and a hub of religious tolerance. Sri Lanka is also the rising star of the Asian economy. Situated at the center of global shipping routes, it plays a vital role in international trade, linking east and west. The country is famous for producing and exporting its world-renowned Ceylon teas, clothing from major global manufacturers, rubber products, jewelry and gems, such as blue sapphires and Twenty-five best trips of the year. The magazine found that, quote, Sri Lanka is finally starting to look like its old self, a peaceful destination where surf lineups are non-existent despite world-class waves, and centuries-old tea estates are lined with mountain bike-ready trails, end quote. During the first half of 2010, tourist arrivals doubled compared to the same time the previous year. In May 2009, Sri Lanka prevailed in a decades-long conflict against the terrorist group Liberation Tigers of Tamil Elam. A U.S. Senate report called the victory one of the few times in history that a terrorist group has ever been defeated. Sri Lanka has now returned to peace and prosperity. The government, with the assistance of foreign aid, has devoted millions of dollars to develop and restore life in the areas affected by the decades-long conflict. Roads Nineteen down and one to go. But before we find out what it is, here's a quick recap. At ten was one of the Caribbean's finest, St. Lucia. At nine, the eastern flavor of Hong Kong. At number eight, the dreamy Seychelles. The island of the gods, Bali came in at seven, while Sicily made it to six. At number five, Manhattan Island. And at number four was Mauritius. At three, we had magical Zanzibar. And at two, exotic Sri Lanka. Marco Polo, who was probably the first world traveler, 
He called it his favorite island. He called it a jade pendant in the Indian Ocean, and that's exactly what it is. It's got absolutely everything. It's got some amazing undiscovered beaches. You can still very much there have a beach to yourself. And with 100 miles of unspoilt sandy beaches and some magnificent coral and marine life, Sri Lanka is arguably one of the world's greatest islands for beaches. It's got a wonderful history and culture in a really small space. And you don't get to number two without some must-see sites. And the ancient city of Sagiria, a 5th century fortress perched atop a rock, is unmissable, not least for the views. You've got amazing national parks with elephants and leopards. The wildlife is a major highlight. The elephant orphanage at Pinawala is the best of its kind. And from starting in 1975 with just seven jumbos, it now has 65, making it the largest herd in captivity. You've got lovely food if you like your spicy curries, and this is definitely the place to go. You go to Sri Lanka, and you can find just a little bit of everything. You couldn't be bored in a million years. From that refreshing soak in a pool To way up in the misty cool From the swell and the swish To that taste but titillating dish from an encounter with the ancient past to a jungle impression that will surely last from the bedazzling sparkle of gems to diving underwater with snorkel or lens From observing the likes of organic devotion to submitting to expert Ayurvedic manipulation. From pursuing adventure or even genteel sports. To shopping for items of all sorts. Undertaking treks and walks to meeting pachyderms up close at our wildlife parks. Feel the heat and magnificence of our fellow. of spices and seasonings. This is Sri Lanka, the resplendent isle. An ancient cross point from east to west, compact and delightful, with people of alluring shade and vivacity.
welcoming you to a land like no other.